we have a two process in a EWM system. One is the POSC, process oriented storage control. One is the layout oriented storage control. Okay. So using the process oriented storage control, you can capture the multi steps. As I said, unloading, staging, deconsolidation, then final put away or VAS activity like this. Using the POAC you can perform. Or something layout oriented storage control, you can do the unloading. And but only thing the uh, desert uh, uh, LOAC is LOAC, um, it won't uh, directly see using a POAC, using POAC, I can unload. Okay. Then I can deliver to the direct to the locations, direct to the locations. But when I'm going LOAC, LOAC, you cannot, you cannot unload then you cannot deliver to directly here. Okay, that means it may not possible. Layout oriented control. Instead of going from staging area to directly, what you mean? It may go for some work center or that is called ID point. ID point. Okay, from staging area to the ID point. From ID point, okay, you will move to the relevant list. Okay, without ID point, so layout, you cannot perform the layout oriented control. Okay. And there are a combination, always we go for the process oriented storage control with uh, layout oriented storage control. The combination we use, extensive we use combination. If you go back at the last two sessions, we have done so extensively with the real time, you know, whatever we did, some, some of the projects, you know, real time, you know, we did for that. Complex out of complex. We cover complex out of complex. We have done a lot of testing, you know, it's almost maybe 10 testings we might have done for the POS and OS. Okay, here combination LOS, we can cap, if at all you want to capture the conveyors, everything, you know, uh, even lift, conveyors, complex conveyors, you know, we can use a layout word in